Okay, before we talk about the weekend weather, which does include thunderstorm chances, let's talk about this Saharan dust cloud. You know, I've been getting a lot of tweets and emails saying, when is the dust storm going to hit? This is not going to be a dust storm by any stretch of the imagination. It's just some dust in the upper levels of the atmosphere. And what it's going to do is when we have partly sunny or clear conditions, it'll cause some haze out there. You're, notice, you're going to notice the haze in the atmosphere tomorrow into Sunday. And if we can get clear skies, no clouds, during the early morning or the evenings, uh, that should make for some brilliant sunrises and sunsets with lots of reds, lots of oranges. On the negative side of things, uh, it could irritate your allergies. If you have respiratory issues, it could give you a few problems. So you might wanna just stay inside the cool of a building tomorrow into Sunday as we have air quality alerts in effect both weekend days. All right, as far as today's weather goes, nice day again. Warm, certainly, a little bit more muggy, but it's late June after all, right? 91 and 68, the extremes on this Friday. We're at 89 right now, humidity just shy of 50%. A southwest breeze that's been blowing pretty decently for the better part of the day, still over 15 miles per hour. Radar scan, okay, if you have outdoor plans the next few hours, walk around the block and it'll be throwing the football with the little ones in the backyard, whatever the case may be. We are dry right now. We're going to stay dry as we roll through the night. All of the viewing area in fine shape at this point in the game. So your detailed Friday evening forecast will take you from the upper 80s at 7 into the low 80s by 10 and 11 o'clock tonight with clear to partly cloudy skies. Here's the big picture. Most of the action throughout the day has been poised off to the north or northeast of us. Some bigger storms in northern portions of Ohio. Big storms right now, southern portions of Wisconsin. This is the weather. This is the activity that we're watching for the upcoming weekend. Right now, it is severe. We have severe thunderstorm watches in effect for Milwaukee, Sh Chicago, Rockford, the Quad Cities. Uh, in uh, the flashing areas you see, those are uh, severe thunderstorm warnings, some pretty high winds a pretty good bet up in those regions. Now we'll stay dry tonight through tomorrow morning. Temperatures will be a mix of upper 60s and low 70s when you wake up on your Saturday morning. Heading through the day tomorrow, just mostly cloudy skies. I think the best chances for a few scattered showers during the day tomorrow, downstate Kentucky and basically south of the parkways. The rest of the region during the day looks basically dry, kind of warm and humid. But that will be changing tomorrow night on into Sunday morning primarily. I think everybody will get into some showers and storms. And some of these could be kind of strong as well, mind you. So the best rain chances this weekend will come uh, tomorrow night into Sunday morning. And then we'll see those chances dropping off Sunday afternoon. Here's our forecast now. A few clouds, warm and dry. Those numbers falling through the 80s. We'll wake up to 74 in the morning. 82 middle of the day tomorrow with that chance for showers well south of Louisville. And then everybody sees the storm chances tomorrow night into Sunday morning. And those lingering scattered storm chances will last in the next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, before we dry it out Thursday and Friday, just in time for the 4th of July weekend, which by the way, I looked ahead, Rick, Jennifer, it looks great right now. Lots of sunshine and warm conditions for both Friday and Saturday of next weekend. Hey, awesome. Yeah. Perfect.